What's up, YouTube? It's Are You Living You? It is February 21st or 2nd. I am almost at the top of Loveland Pass. And just wanted to do a little bit of uh, road, do illegal driving and, and filming. I need a, I need a uh, thing. <laughs> so I'm going to take a couple free runs, hitchhike back up to the top. Maybe get a little video in between of some of that, but I'm going to pause for a moment. I'm living me, are you living you? So at the top of Loveland Pass, and it's going to take me a while to get my stuff together to take a run down. I may have bitten off more than I can chew. It's been 15 years since I snowboarded, um, but a guy, I talked to a guy, asked him a couple questions about how it works and he said it's pretty actually moderate terrain and it all ends up in the same place and then he said that the avalanche risk was moderate today and his, his girlfriend the girl he was with said um she kind of like laughed at him and said no it's not but instead of stay in the trees it's not obviously you can't really get avalanches in trees you can but not nearly as easily so I wanted to do a sweep around of the view, but it is insanely windy. So I might just hop out and do it real quick. Um, sorry about that. If I can mute it, I will. But very, very windy, so uh, just living another day, trying to do, live me, my life, be happy, and I am extremely happy, so hopefully you are too, and if you're not, it takes a lot of work, <laughs> and you have to be present in the moment, and okay with today, have visions, goals, a perspective to understand that that's something you're working towards so be okay with today that's how i figured out how to get happy i'm living me are you living you have a great day this brief little interlude is to explain why you will not find any actual footage of me snowboarding i did go down the hill there was some moderate terrain and then it turned into basically double black diamond and how <clears throat> handled the first part pretty good did fall a couple of times but wasn't too pretty on the bottom part and I'm gonna get a pass for next year so I can use it in the spring and you know get better on a, some blue runs couple day trips and then provide some footage of me snowboarding at that time there are a couple pictures the guy took of me and he sent them to me via text uh, a couple days later so I'll provide those now and just another reminder to uh, look into grounding because it's uh, changing my life for the better so back up to the mountain hey guys so I did it I went down Loveland Pass free road um, I'll admit, it, it kicked my ass after 15 years, but it was a lot of fun. I, I'm, I'm thrilled that I came up here. I'm thrilled that I got some financial obligations out of the way. And it's pretty much just smooth sailing for me from now on. I work when, if and when I want to work, I, I, or I do this, I, or I go fishing or whatever. I, I'm absolutely thrilled. I'm going to probably get a few runs in on like hard blue intermediate runs um buy a buy a pass somewhere um that was a little challenging for me i was definitely just scooting down some spots on my back uh up my heel edge anyway guys just checking in wanted to yes i did in fact take take a run down on my snowboard which is out front of my van so uh thanks for watching guys like, share, subscribe, and I'm living me. Are you living you?